What's up, guys? Welcome back, man. It has been so long since we had my beautiful girl out. It's so funny how she gets this brown coloration there throughout the winter. And then once it gets sunny, and I get her outside more, this, this beautiful green comes down. But uh, but today we got a little bit of an issue, so I wanted to show you guys. She's uh, she's tore a nail. Um, what kind of was this hand? Which hand is it? Oh, it's right there. She's actually tore her nail. Let's see if I can show you. You kind of see a little bit right there. Um, remember, their nails are much like uh, like birds. Uh, they, they get blood that flows through them, which is one reason you got to be careful when you're clipping them. A lot of people uh, like to file them. And I, I do, honestly. I clip her nails. They're honestly not that bad. But I think it's the thick wiring of her going up and down. So I'm going to have to figure out something new. But, hey, it's just one of those things, like I say, I try to, I try to be here alongside you guys you know um i see a lot of enclosures and that's where i got the idea from i tried to stay away from the thin chicken wire but hey it, it, it still seems like this nail it's only this one this is the second time uh but i wanted to show her because i do think she's beautiful i love iguanas obviously they are a little bit of a nuisance but i mean look at the power and size of this thing i've seen a lot of people <laughs> talking about they're gonna buy their kid an iguana I wouldn't suggest it, okay? First of all, you never buy your kid anything, especially a reptile, because you are going to end up taking care of it. It's just a fact. It doesn't matter how old they are. They're going to love it for a week, maybe two if you're lucky. Then after that, you're like, oh my God, Joe, will you please come take this reptile? And then my wife's going to say, no, Joe, we got enough. We ain't taking no more. See, and then you, 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 go, you run into that. But you can tell this is a very, very powerful animal. Gorgeous. Gorgeous uh, butthead, if you guys have seen, but powerful. We had her in the bath, I was gonna show you, but then the bathroom ended up looking like a murder scene because we had her in the bathtub and she got out. <laughs> she got out while we were trying to let this soak a little bit. Um, but we're gonna do a little doctoring up and, uh, and hope that it'll make it a little better. So come on. Dude, the greatest thing ever. Man, look, if you're a kid, an adult, or an iguana, the triple antibiotic ointment. Did I say that right? I think I said that right. Whatever. We all know what it is. This stuff right here, we're going to put it on her nail. Um, and then I'm going to hope that she's just going to sit there on her platform uh, and stay off of her nail for a little bit. She keeps picking it up, which is a uh, big indicator that it's obviously hurting. So. God, look at her. Look how calm she's been. Some of y'all that have been following this iguana for so long. I would, did you ever think you would see her acting like this? I mean, from whipping my face off. See if you can try to not let that touch your shirt and okay. just put it straight in there. Okay. Because it's just coated. Right. So we got it coated on there. Uh, it doesn't seem like it, it ripped off. It just seems like it just tore a little bit. So uh, obviously reptiles are resilient and it should heal fine if she'll stay off of it. So come on, we're going to put her back. We get to the door. So I'm hoping that she's just going to climb right up on her platform, which we've cleared a little bit. I'm going to hold her foot just to help get her up there. Perfect. Perfect. Look, and she didn't whip me. Whoa, boy, that is a win. I'm telling y'all, telling you. Uh, this iguana is a butthead, but today she was a sweetheart. She must have known I was just trying to take care of her. I mean, look, you got to start with one and end with another. Another beautiful female that I have in my house. Me and my girl, Rona, we're going to also go take some, some bath a little bit, get some rips, get some loving. She's she's the cuddle bug. She's the cuddle bug. Yes, you are. She's the cuddle bug. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember, take care of your reptiles. Don't buy them for your kids unless you want to take care of them. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time, baby. Hey, don't be, don't be trying to show out now that you're on 